Hi, Cat's Cradle here. I am happy today to be able to show you how to make chicken salad from home canned chicken. I love having boneless, skinless chicken breast on my pantry shelf. I especially like it when I've canned it myself and I know what's in it, how it's been uh, carefully handled and prepared and that it has no preservatives. My favorite thing to use it for is to make homemade chicken salad, which I make almost every week. Prepper A much prefers it to anything I can buy in the store, especially any kind of lunch meat or anything like that. And it's very quick to make. It has very few ingredients and it goes together very quickly. In this bowl, I have already grated with my microplane some onion and some celery. I grate a lot of celery. For a quart jar, I would probably grate four whole ribs. And what you uh, haven't seen me do, somehow I didn't get this captured on video, is after I grate that onion and celery, it weeps a good bit. There's a good bit of moisture that comes out of it. I just used a, pa a paper towel to soak up the liquid that comes out of the celery and onion so that that's not making my chicken salad soggy. So what you're seeing now in that bowl is grated celery, grated onion, and one quart of chicken breast. I'm actually making this to take to a family uh, who is having a funeral tomorrow and uh, uh, lost a beloved mother to a, a long fight with cancer. And while I know they'll get a lot of casseroles and cakes and cookies and things like that, I want them to have something to use that they can just take out of the refrigerator and spread on a piece of fresh bread and uh, be able to make a quick sandwich without having to uh, fine plates and heat up in the microwave, that kind of thing. It's just nice. It's just a, a great comfort food. I've decided that one quart of chicken isn't enough, so I went ahead and got another quart. I drained the broth off to use for soup or uh, to use for the liquid uh, in a pot of rice or something like that. I just want the chicken, the dry chicken. And you can see here why it is best to can the chicken in a wide mouth jar because once that chicken is cooked and cooled, it forms to the inside of that jar. And so you have to kind of pry it out to get it out of a small mouth, but it works okay. And uh, these are the hardest jars, jars to clean of all the home canned food uh, I can. You really have to have a baby bottle brush to get down in there to scrub that out, or you, know, you have to send a rag down and use a spoon to scrape the sides. Um, but here I'm showing you how the chicken just breaks apart. I must admit, I use my fingers most of all to break it apart, uh, but you can also do it with a fork if you find that offensive. It just crumbles up almost like tuna, but even better. I put lots of uh, fresh cracked black pepper. I put a little bit of salt. Of course, I can my chicken with some salt, so I'm careful about adding the salt. A lot of parsley flakes, and sometimes I even add a little celery seed as well. I'll put a recipe for you below so that you'll you'll know what to do here. Uh, just a little salt, and then I taste it when I'm done mixing it. If I need to add some more salt, I will. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull up that celery and onion from the bottom of the pan and start mixing that in a little bit just to moisten my dry herbs there so they'll rehydrate. And then I'm going to add the mayonnaise. This looks like a lot of mayonnaise, but we're talking about two quarts of chicken. That is a lot of chicken. And so now I'm just going to mix this all in. You can do diced celery and diced onion if you don't have a microplane. I just don't like my chicken salad to be crunchy. I want the flavor of the onion and the celery without the crunch. So here I am, I'm going to put it in a pretty antique bowl here, but first I'm going to taste it and make sure there's enough salt and that the seasoning is just right. And it tastes delicious. So I'm going to show you how it looks. I don't want to serve it in the, the bowl that I mixed it up in. I want to put it into a clean, pretty bowl. This is so delicious. I can't even begin to tell you. And it is one of my best go-to foods because I can whip it up so quickly. I just love the way the chicken just crumbles. Uh, it's so easy. If you've never tried it, you're going to love this. I'm going to uh, do a little taste test here with Prepper A, uh, which is kind of hilarious because she has me make this every Monday morning because she, when she takes a break from her school work, this is what she eats, a chicken salad sandwich. Let's hear what she has to say.
hey, would you like to take a taste of your chicken salad? I already know you'd love it. Talk to the front of the camera because the microphone's not very good. So they can hear you. This is the best chicken salad ever. I most definitely prefer it over any kind of lunch meat. So good. Well, there you have it. Kids don't lie. Chicken salad from Home Can Chicken. I hope you give it a try. Until next time, this is Cat's Cradle.